tonight. A Houston area couple's fast food order came with something they did not expect. They found a screw, but not until after one of them chewed on it. Tonight, they are demanding accountability from the restaurant that they ate at. KPRC 2's Rowan Belogan is live near the Chipotle on FM 2920 in Tomball with what the health department is doing about all of this. Rowan. Okay, Daniela, this is that Chipotle behind me here on FM 20, 2920 here. Now, the woman you're about to meet tells me she picked up her order that she placed a few days ago. And while still in this parking lot, she was going through the bag, making sure her guac, chips, and everything else was in there. But when she made it home, that's when they found something they didn't ask for, a screw. It was just, it was so loud. Like, it. It, it, it didn't sound right, and it sounded like it kind of hurt a little bit. Desiree Amstead said it sounded like her fiance was chewing on rocks when he dug into his Chipotle. Shortly after he spits it out, it wasn't rocks, but a screw. And they still have it and the half-eaten meal. We just kind of sat there in awe and just stared at each other for like a moment of silence, just like, what just happened? Um, then we figured we would go back to Chipotle. Back to Chipotle they went, and their dash camera shows them speaking with the manager. He had the kind of attitude of like, oh, well, I'm sorry. I don't know what I can do for you. I'm just like as if we just went in there just to tell him just because we went in there because we wanted him to know, be aware of it and hopefully fix the problem. So that way if a screw doesn't end up in somebody else's food. To say the least, it wasn't the reaction they expected. So they reached out to us. We first tried vetting Amstead's event of things by reaching out to Chipotle. I didn't get a call back, but she did. First thing he said whenever he called me was that, He's calling me because KPRC had reached out to him and um, it brought him, it brought everything to his attention. The Chipotle corporate rep told her the manager didn't follow proper protocol and file an incident reports. We now know the Harris County Public Health Department sent an inspector. One of our investigators is out there, um, actually, as we speak, um, conducting an inspection. We check everything, right? So uh, machinery that they have in restaurants is, you know, what's what's called food grade. Um, so there are certain requirements and stuff that they have to meet, and uh, we always check that stuff. What do you hope to get out of all of this? I would like Chipotle to be held accountable for this, though, and hopefully investigate where these screws are coming from. Now, I did hear back from Chipotle Corporation, corporate, but they didn't really tell me much besides saying that they reached directly to the couple who filed this complaint. The couple, however, telling me that they did get a refund for their order and that Chipotle's insurance representative would be reaching out to them after one of them heads to the hospital. Reporting live in Tomball, Robon Belogan, KPRC 2 News.